Hi there everyone. Okay, so I wanted to make a video and uh, hopefully this gets shared and hopefully I can help some people out. There has been a lot of people that have private messaged me um, regarding their friends or their family or um, somebody knows somebody who knows somebody and they need information about transitioning. Um, I remember when I first uh, decided that I was going to transition. I had no clue where to start. I had no clue where to who to talk to. I had I had no idea on you know the steps that were involved with um, transitioning for me from female to male. Um, but through a lot of persistence and a lot of googling and a lot of missteps, um, I found my way. I know how difficult it was for me to uh, come against that brick wall where I felt I, I wasn't going to make it and that I just needed to stop because there was no way for me to, uh, to figure it out on my own. So I want this video to go um, so you can share it and you can give it to people who... Um, are lost and they feel like they can't move forward anymore. Um, there are a lot of kiddos out there that um, they're, they're committing suicide. There's a lot of adults. There's a lot of people that are trans in general that are just wanting to commit suicide because one, they don't know where to start. Two, they have no support from anyone. Um, and three, they... <sighs> They're, they just feel like they're, um, what's the word I'm looking for, an ab uh, abomination to mankind, to humanity, to um, their family. Um, unfortunately, we can get into that space when we can get into that spot where... <sighs> We don't really know if there's any other answers. Um, and then there's a lot of people right now who are transitioning um, and they're being murdered right now. Um, there's all, so many trans deaths in, in our country and out of the country right now. Um, it, it just people, uh, there was a trans woman that was drugged out of her house um, and was beaten with sandals with boards with everything and people were cheering that on and then she was taken in the back alley and beaten some more and then she was shot um this is reality unfortunately right now and there's a lot of people that um are terrified of transitioning because of this um or stopping their transition which you can't really stop being who you are and, and, and even though they stop their transition it doesn't make them untransgender that's you know what I mean um, so my hopes for this is to give people a safe space um, to give them the information that they need so they are not harming themselves by um, buying estrogen or tea uh, through places that they shouldn't um, for over medicating themselves if you you know you decide hey and we're just gonna go on the F2M site um, side and uh, we're gonna go with the testosterone um, if somebody is transitioning and they do too much teeth they can end up really one damaging themselves and two end up with you know rage and it's it's an ugly picture and there, there's so many other things that can happen from you know not taking your you know not going to a doctor and getting um your blood work done and finding out how much that you have to have there's a reason why there's doctors that are in this field because they you know they know what they're doing and they know you know what your body is already at and how much to give you yada 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 okay so I promised that this wasn't gonna be long so I'm trying really hard not to not to get into too many rants here so um, people have PM been private messaging me um, asking if they can give um, their friend or whoever um, my information so um, yes anyone that is um, in your life that is asking for help 
Um, yes, you can give them my information. No, do not give them my cell phone. You can tell them that they can private message me on Facebook. Now, I am taking a risk at doing this because you have no clue who is out there that could um, be searching for me for a bad reason. Um, so I would ask that you... If you're giving someone my info, you know this person because I am trusting you. I know you. So, if you're giving somebody my information, please think about me when you're doing so, okay? Think about who they are giving this information to. Do you trust these people? If you don't and you feel weird about it, have them um, contact um, uh, like Rainbow Alley or something along those lines in, in Colorado. I trust you to take care of me. So, um, I am here to give any information that anybody needs, um, give any information to whoever needs it, and um, make sure that they are able to have the tools that they need to transition if that is something that they want to do. I have decided that I'm going to take this journey, and um, I am. it is something that I have to do. Because that's, one, the type of person that I am. And, two, there's too many people that are committing suicide or anything along those lines that, that's down a dark path because they don't feel like they are going to be able to move forward. So, short and sweet, yes, I am here to help. Yes, they can private message me on Facebook. No, do not give them my personal information, such as my phone number. Um, my uh, my email is it's you can you can give them my email. That's not a problem. I am actually going to create an email specifically uh, for this reason that uh, that way people can um, email me at that email um, once I have it set up I will post it with this video so you can um, give them that information as well um, I'm really serious and very passionate about this guys so uh, if if there's somebody out there and they need help please send them my way um, also if this is kind of on the same realm, but a little bit different. Um, if there's any um, teachers out there or education educational people that are out there that um, would like me to speak to their kids, to uh, their group, to anything along those lines, please message me. Um, I would be more than happy to uh, speak to any any venue. Um, People need information, they need education, and they need to know that they're not alone. So, yes, I will be more than happy to do that. Um, ooh, there's also, um, I would like to be able to travel and be able to go and speak anywhere. So, if that's something that you are interested in and would like me to come and give people, you know, we could talk to them and have them ask me questions, bring it on. Uh, this is something, like I said, I've decided that I'm going to take on and that's something that I feel like I am supposed to do. So, rambling over, I love you guys and um, I hope that this helps and I hope that I'm able to open the door for people that need it. Um, everybody needs a helping hand um, no matter what the situation and I'm hoping that in this I can help plenty of people. So, um... I love you. I hope everybody is well. And uh, please, please contact me so that I can help make sure that uh, we aren't losing any more of our, our transgendered people. All right. I love you guys. Have a great day. And uh, it's almost the weekend. So have a good weekend and be safe.